the orientation of cephalocaudal ends before the third week start there will be formation of precaudal plate so the formation of precaudal plate represents the cranial end of the embryo so here is the formation of precaudal plate where the few cells in the hypoblast layer become columnar in nature and they become thick adherent to the overlying epiblast and this forms a precaudal plate which represents the cranial end of the embryo and also it is an organizer for the development of head region so this represents the cranial end of the disc and the other side the opposite side will be the caudal end of the disc so caudal end it is represented by a diverticulum so the posterior wall of the yolk sac so you can see here this is the disc by laminar germ disc above that is the amniotic cavity and below is the yolk sac so the posterior wall of the yolk sac will form a small diverticulum which enters the connecting stalk so this is the connecting stalk is the area where the germ disc is connected to the trophoblast so this small diverticulum will be called as allantois so the presence of allantois and the connecting stalk represents the caudal end of the disc and the presence of precaudal plate represents the cranial end of the disc the formation of precaudal plate